Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, just want to talk real quick about a couple of holsters that I got from West Tech Holsters. Um, from a guy named Wesley uh, Slusser on uh, Facebook. Um, got some really good stuff going on here. Um, I saw Wesley's. Uh, he had, he had made a post, and it said he had made a uh, holster for his P twenty one twenty one light. I'm sorry, I keep saying that. It's a P12 Nightcore light. I had the same light. And uh, he had made a mag light holster combination. And I was, you know, jokingly, I said, when you want to make some money, you know, let me know. I want one of those. I really wanted one, but I didn't think he'd make me one. And uh, come to find out, he actually made holsters. So uh, I asked him, would he, would he make me a holster? And he made me one. And this is the first holster he made me. It's for a uh, Glock 23 mag, or a Glock mag, you might as well say, and a uh, P12, I'm getting it right, <laughs> Nightcore light. Now, this is the MH12, and uh, if you have that light, I have the P12, I lost it, and uh, I, I got the, P, uh, the MH12, and it's the exact same dimension. So, P12 and uh, MH12, same light, same dimensions, basically. Uh, if you if you got either one, they'll fit. Or he can make a uh, holster for whatever you're wanting. So this is what I got. Uh, the holster is it's pretty thick. You can see it's not thin. It's not going to flex. It's not going to collapse in on itself. Um, it's already contoured for your belt to go around your body. It has four screws in here, and uh, Glock magazines. There's really no need for a retention screw, so there's not one there. Uh, but the way it fits is uh, it's just you know here's the light. Right in there. Got yourself a Glock magazine. I know they're loaded. Sorry, people. Um, snaps right in there. Very good retention. Very good retention. You can run, jump, whatever you need to do. If you're, if you're, uh, I don't know, security, or whatever. Uh, this would make a good duty holster because it's really functional. Uh, you can easily pull out your light and uh, activate it if you need to, or whatever. So. And uh, he did such a good job at making this one holster. I went back to him again and I asked, will you make me a holster for my uh, my Ruger SR9C? And uh, he said, sure. Now, the, it's, there's a difference here. Um, Glock magazines have this little catch here. So it's, you know, you just make a catch for that, but not a Ruger magazine. It's smooth, both sides, pretty symmetrical. There's, you know, there's nothing to grab onto. Uh, so, I was wondering how he's going to pull that off. Um, of course, the light fits really good, but the the mag is, the the Ruger mag good retention. Look at that, good retention. It's not coming out, but if you need, he's got a little retention screw here. I haven't had to even touch it, so uh, you know it, it's great. There again, contour to the body. You've got that thick Kydex going on, and I wear, this is what I wear the most. Uh, you would think, you know, I'm a Glock guy, but I, I've been in, I'm in denial. <laughs> I, I love the Ruger SR9C. I love it more since I got this holster, because uh, it's got really good retention. On there. And uh, if, you, if you're one of those guys that are going to carry your, uh, you know, you're going to carry your 17 rounder, it fits right in there. You got good retention on your 17 rounder also. So if you're gonna need more rounds, it's not gonna be an issue. You can carry that also. Uh, love, and I do mean love, these holsters. Uh, I wear my light every day, everywhere. Everywhere I go, I keep a light with me. It's a real force habit. So when I go to work, I can't carry because uh, I'm filming off of my uh, semi now, but uh, I, I'm not allowed to carry in the semi. But the holsters were, I mean, I love these holsters, and, and you know, I, I should have brought out my, we all have an individual light holster that comes with your light. Then you have maybe your Leatherman holster that comes with your Leatherman, or your multi-tool, or whatever it is that you carry. Um, I asked Wesley, would he make me a holster for my Leatherman, and, of course, my light, which has to come with me. And I sent him the Leatherman, and he sent me back this. Another great holster. Uh, 
nor that. That's just because I have I get I get them confused. They they look so similar. Uh, so that's just a marker. There again, contoured. You've got that thick kydex, really thick kydex, and you got your four screws going on. So now I can carry my light at work and my Leatherman. Now I'm not going to be running with this, but if I should have to, uh, good retention, you know, great retention. So, you know, hopefully I won't be doing any running. Uh, truckers are fat. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. We're not fat. We're not all fat. <laughs> but uh, he, he made me a holster for pretty much everything that I carry. Uh, he's got one for my Ruger, one for my Glock, one for my Leatherman at work. And I just wanted to make a video to show this guy's got quality work. And uh, this stuff is great. And uh, when I'm around the house, if I weren't making this video right now, I'd be wearing the, you know, my SR9C one because I, I wear them all the time, every day. Uh, I put them through, you know, the wear and tear, taking them on, taking them off, taking them off. Here's a, uh, a side note. You got to have a good belt, people, because these holsters do pull in close. They, they pull in really close to the body. They don't sag. The weight of the light in the magazine, they don't sag outward. You know what I mean? They, they pull in close. It's good retention. They're really close. They're low profile. I can still carry with these. And, uh, but I do have a, a pretty good belt, a decent belt. And that would be the, uh, I, I wear a Fusion. I know a lot of guys wear SOE. Uh, when I can justify getting one, I'm going to get one. But in the meantime, I wear just a rigorous belt, very stiff, rigid belt. And that's going to be the key to it. So, you know, you're not going to be wearing a Walmart belt. And, uh, you, can, you know, you can't complain if it sags because you're wearing a cheap belt. You go ahead and spend the money, get a quality belt. And, uh, good stiff belt and these will not say they won't pull away from the body and, the, and that's pretty that's I just think that's absolutely awesome and I just want to take a second to give West Tech holsters uh, a big thank you for making these holsters for me uh, when I can afford more firearms <laughs> I'm sorry when the wife allows me to fi uh, afford more firearms I'll be getting more firearms and more holsters because uh, this is a really great product and I appreciate everyone uh, from taking the time to watch and uh, you should really check out West Tech Holsters because if you want a quality product that's not going to break the bank, uh, that's where you're going to find it at. And uh, I would give my seal of approval 100% West Tech Holsters. All right, thanks.